Hey folks, getting ready to uh, create my Savonius vertical axis wind turbine setup. Um, I had briefly shown the axle. I had a bunch of crap on it before, but it's just half of a trailer axle. The, the you know, right there, four four bolts on it, and uh, fairly spins fairly freely, and uh, it's got channel steel on it that uh, happens to uh, be just slightly larger in diameter than the pole that I sunk into the middle of the dome pond. And uh, so this will actually uh, encase the, the, the pipe sticking out of the, uh, the, the pond. And I'll just, uh, just clamp it onto it and uh, the rest of it will be mounted onto here, including this trailer tire, extra wide I have no idea what for what use probably for I don't know carrying roller paper, roller painters or something. But uh really wide tire, high volume. Exact same bolt size. I'm gonna fill it with water with a flywheel and I'm gonna mount it. From the bottom instead of the top where it's supposed to be mounted. I'm going to mount it from the bottom of it and bolt it through and then my uh, turbine blades can be mounted on top of that. So that should get a, bit, a little extra heft and a little bit of wind and what's, what's cool is that when he, uh, when he cuts this completely in half like this right across the top like he's doing right now, I'm gonna, I'll be able to, to line up one porthole on one side to the porthole on the other side and that'll give me a really wide span wingspan on it and uh, the more surface area you got to catch wind the more torque you can get out of the, the setup so um not only that but uh you know the, the holes will be perfect for lining up into the center of the hub as well on the uh on the trailer axle so everything is coming together uh just a little update i uh, got the perfect bolts and everything for it so far See it.